Welcome. My name is Tom Downs and I'm a member of the ITS department here at Syracuse University. And I'd like to take a few minutes to show you around a little space we call the uh, ITS Multifunctional Studio, which is available right now for faculty here on main campus. And we have some great technology for any faculty interested in creating and packaging some of their digital content for the purposes of their instruction. The uh, studio I'm referring to is located in the BRL building, which is, uh, if you don't know, it's at, right attached to Sims Hall, uh, about a block down from the uh, bus terminal stop on College Place, so it's very conveniently located. It's a multifunctional, as I said, studio, and I want to tell you and show you a couple of things we have right here today that you could use if you're interested in coming by for a tour. Uh, for example, I'm standing right next to, you maybe see a piece of glass right here. We have a light board, and maybe you've heard of the, uh, what light board technology is. It's pretty popular among some universities. Instructors can come and use the light board, and they can instruct by writing on this piece of glass, which appears as if they're writing almost in thin air, because there's technology involved and technicians who can videotape you as you instruct, as you freely do, just like you would in a classroom, writing on a board and articulating your thoughts to a camera. That's just one piece of technology. The uh, studio also has two very high-end Sony high-definition cameras, which could be used to capture uh, traditional lectures if you're interested in doing that. If you wanted to bring a subject matter expert to the studio and have a talking head video, we can capture that as well. And outside of having the cameras and the light board technology, there's industrial grade lighting and we're always increasing the technology in this uh, facility. So please come by the BRL building, contact ITS if you're interested in having some kind of a tour and let us know what you think.